What's up, you guys? guys? Welcome back to another video. video. And you guys saw the title of today's video, and you guys are probably like, bruh. Another one. Another one. When is it gonna stop? Never. Never. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I'm actually gonna um, explain to you guys why we are going car shopping. For those of you guys who don't know, basically we have the Cadillac and we have the Hellcat. We have this Mercedes and the XXM competition is my car. We modified that car and we actually really didn't realize how loud the car was until I got state ref. For those of you guys who don't know what a state ref is, it basically means that your car is is modified and technically illegal in the state of California. So you made me pop my hood and I do have an intake in the hood so I didn't have my sticker for the intake so they gave me a state ref. Overall the car is amazing you guys and I'm actually very sad to see the car go. Did you crawl in your lap? And we need Bobini's with us you guys. The X6M was Brittany's first ever car like this is very meaningful to Brittany. I can get the ticket written off as well but I don't want a loud car anymore. It's a much safer route to like just get a normal car for Brittany like we we still have the Hellcat and the Escalade, they're loud cars. Basically, I'm just gonna go look at like different cars that I'm in the process of getting. Like, yes, I do have this Mercedes, but, and yes, I do have the Escalade, but honestly, you guys, I feel like if I really have the financial, like, ability to get another car, like, why not? Like, we're gonna go look at a couple of cars, you guys. Let me oh. know which one you guys like the most. Let's go to our first destination. Wait, wait, before we go, give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, hit the post notification, and share this video to everybody you know. Dropped off the Mercedes for service. Well, it's not service. They're just gonna fix the brake light. It basically fell out. I don't even know how a guard told me it did. Damn, look at this one. Jeez. Guys, fun fact, I used to work here as a porter. We're gonna look at the G-Wagons today. So Winnie's just walking around, having a good time with his Goyard collar. So right now, Brittany wants to look at the G-Wagons. That's an option, even though everybody has a G-Wagon. Okay, okay, these are new G-Wagons. Brittany says she likes this one. Ooh, Red Guts, come on. This looks like Brandon's. That new car smells insane. I love how the doors close on this. And they got the G right here, come on. Nothing like that new car smell. Nothing beats that, huh? Winnie, what do you think about this one? Uh, All he does is sleep, bro. You look good in it. Thanks. You like the color that one? That one has We're black. still gonna go look at the Range Rover, but yeah. personally, I've always loved the G-Wagon. I don't know, I just feel like every girl has this car. Who cares, honestly. Yeah. It's still a sick ass whip, I'm not gonna lie. That's why everybody has it. Oh, it's 183. Yeah, not bad. This Maybach got sold. Not my cup of tea. When I was a porter, I used to come in here and always like look at the cars and be like, damn, this shit is so nice. Wow, whoa, what is this? Sheesh, it's orange. Maybachs are tough. Oh, this is the color on our car. It's like a bronze, two-tone. This color on a G-Wagon would be insane. I'm very observant with cars. I don't know, Bernie's very interested in that white G-Wagon over there. She's calling her parents to see what they think. Look at these rims, bro. I don't know, I don't know how I feel about that, but that's crazy. We are out of Mercedes-Benz on Van Nuys. Honestly, when I worked here, guys, there was a salesman named Gary, and he's still here. I just seen him again. He was like the top salesman, and I think he still is the top salesman. Very good businessman, honestly. We were just chatting it up with them and catching up. We might come back for that G-Wagon. We might. Honestly, they told me that um, an all-black one just sold. All black. With the white with interior. white interior, and it just sold. But that's the spec that I want for the Range Rover. And honestly, a G-Wagon. Just in general, I think that I might just end up just doing matte black. And you guys, they were all loving on me. Oh, yeah. And he was acting like a good boy, even though he's not. I used to be in that showroom as a porter back when the A35 AMG came out, the A-Class. I sent a picture to my dad, and back then it was like, I think, 35000 I'm like, Dad, I really want this, you know? We didn't have the funds for it and stuff, so now that like we could even walk in, or I come in with like an S580, looking at the G-Wagon is like insane to me. Honestly, you know? I like the G-Wagon, you guys. I just think that price was crazy. I, mean, I was like, it does hold its value, babe. It you know? does. I'm just like, <coughs> for that price, I could literally dead ass get a fucking STL, babe. Oh, he's tired. The Land Rover of Woodland Hills. I got my eye on that little dark green one with the white interior. I don't know. <laughs> We're gonna go check out some Range Rovers. Hopefully, they let us record. S Class looking pretty, but this thing, I don't know what Range Rover did, but they're competing with a bunch right now. Oh my goodness. Guys, comment down below what you guys think. 208K. The same price as the G-Wagon. White interior. This competes heavy. This is crazy. Babe, this one's nuts. It has a white interior, white steering oh, wheel. My shirt. 
They got all Weenie's pea spots on them. I love this what? color, bro. This green is crazy. Green. Really? I like. I love the interior. You could wrap it, babe, but I like yeah, this green. Really kind of honestly, so don't look at the color, babe. This is the perfect but interior. The color that I want to wrap it is crazy. Don't oh even say it. Gosh. They have a gray one right here. It doesn't have the black rims though, babe. Same interior. I would say the green one. The green one's tough. Get it. Okay, so this you is could the, wrap it. I'm this saying. This is the other reason why my car. I just I'm kind of over is because I made my car very. I built my car very like boyish. You guys, I'm not like a tomboy or anything. Like I like having like my girly moments. So like, I feel like this is like my girly car, and Garrick's not letting me have that. Like well, I'm letting you, bro. No, you're not. Like you said, you're gonna even wrap this if you get it. Even but that one already comes with the black rims. I know why. So that when I get it, you can take pictures with it while it's green. Hi, Weenie! Yeah. <laughs> Hello! Babe, I'll take pictures of it even if it's fucking the yeah, worst color. Have shit on you too. Oh my gosh, bro. <laughs> Babe, this is an expensive shirt. <laughs> I'm gonna cut his nuts off myself, bro. <laughs> wow, this is crazy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Way more room than the G Wagon. You wanna sit in it, babe? Yeah. Hold on. Yeah, I got him. I just love it already. Damn, look at the look at the wood. I know. On the, uh, around this, huh? Wow, this is actually very nice. Okay, I can see you in this. I can see you in this. <laughs> I think she made up her mind, honestly. I think I did. We're still going to the seat of Enli in the Lambo. Come here. Your bougie mom wants this white one. White interior. Motherfucker, come here. Motherfucker. Mother. Waiting, come on. So stingy with me, bro. The color that I really want to wrap it, Garik just said, it. even if it's that color, I'm still oh. gonna drive it. Sick, bro. I like sure. how it has the TVs in the back too. Yeah, wow, this hell is sick. So and okay, cool. so you guys, we came and we saw the SV version, but this Loki has like the same things, doesn't it? It's not worth the SV version. Yeah, that's the like SV one. version is like 300k. Yeah, yeah, I might as well get a fucking Maybach. Yeah, might. I would. Been. I would rather get a Maybach. This is sick, bro. You Range like Rover it? did its thing with this one. That's crazy. I could be like, all right, babe, drive me. What the fuck? They're gonna let me test drive it right now. Also, you guys, he took my license inside. Yeah. What the fuck? I'm most definitely probably gonna get this. This right here? Yeah, just push it. Oh, they're about to let Bernie drive it. Shout out Woodland Hills Range Rover. Oh, wow, they got pillows right here. Bougie. Oh, there's a screen. What? Oh. Hey, there's a screen. There's an iPhone right here. Hold on, I'm about to get I'm about to get massaged. He's having way too much fun back there. Lighting. Oh. I could close the roof, open the roof. This is really presidential right here. He's trying to race. He's trying to race. You look at my Hellcats right here. Please. I love how big the steering wheel is, actually. It's so spacious. It's like so bright in here, too. How does it feel? It's so smooth. How does it feel back there? It's so good. Yeah. Honestly, I'm going to be back here most of the time. Oh, you put HDMI on this, Wi Fi. There's Wi Fi in here? Uh, yes. There's a cool box here, too. Oh, wow. There's a. There's a fridge in here, babe. Whoa, what's that? That's just storage. You can put storage. Your, uh, wireless headphones there. I'm chilling back here. These pillows. Look at my leg room, guys. My nuts are breeding. Right He's just chilling. He's tired. Babe, the carpets back here is like. I know. Extravagant. Oh, there's speakers right here too. It comes with this pen, guys. This fluffy. Look, babe. There's a fluffy pen that it comes with. <laughs> oh, I feel it. You guys turn on my massagers? Yeah. You can actually feel these ones. My car has massagers, but you can barely feel it. How much horsepower does this have? Five. Five hundred? Five twenty-eight. Not bad. V8? Yep. Nice. Supercharged. V8 supercharged. Sunroof is huge, too. You could put your like seat positioning in the back. It's crazy. This is a crazy spec. Is this fully loaded? Yeah. Fully loaded. Yeah. I'm calling Brittany's mom, guys. Who do you want? Who do I want? I didn't call anybody. What are you talking? What are you talking about? You literally just called me. I didn't call you. Well, I'm in a 2024 Range Rover right here. Hi, Mama Sita. Look it. She loves it. I love the inside color. I love it. Look, there's a TV right here, and look at the leg room. It's very big in the back for babies. Let me see. No. I'm saying babies, guys, because she has babies. No, there's no Is seats, there seats in the back. In the back? No. no, just there's three Is this seats. A trunk? Yeah, just the trunk. Mm -hmm. But you could like I lay love, down. I love the steering wheel. I know. It drives smooth, and then um, it has like 
black wood on the sides of the steering wheel. Oh, you could adjust the seats. Yeah, you can adjust everything through here, and then this recline fully. Let me try. No way, it reclines. Fully loaded. How does the key look? Okay, okay. It has Wi-Fi. You can get the, like one of those Google Chromecast. Okay. To the HDMI. Have Netflix. Everything there. Netflix or anything? Okay. This might be the one, guys. She loves it. I don't know. We might have to come back for it. Beautiful car. This is the trunk space, guys. So nice, huh? Yeah. For a guy, that green color is insane. The green one's nice, right? Okay. Freaking girls, bro. What'd you think, babe? <laughs> she made up her mind, guys, but we're still gonna go look at the Bentley truck and we're gonna go look at the Lambo truck just to compare. My mom, literally, she's so funny. She's like, I'm gonna take that car every day. No, but I am. What? <laughs> You're smiling at them like that. You're making them uncomfortable. This is another day, not a dollar. We're at a new spot. It's called Fusion Luxury Motorsports. We are gonna be looking at more cars. Hopefully they let us film. If not, we're gonna go somewhere else. I think the like three main cars that I really wanna look at, I have my heart set already. I've been telling Garg I do. And you guys already saw me. We oh, came okay. in the big body caddy. Oh shit. Remember I used to be dusty. This is a Ford Raptor. Smoked this one already with this. Easy GT3. Fuck. I literally saw your kidney for that. Do it. I'm with it. Damn. I need one of these one day. Do you guys have a yours by any chance? The yours? You don't have any. No? Okay. Damn. Is this a scat pack? What? Babe, I'm about to buy one of these, bro. Wow, babe. Just do it. It was just a GT3. Just do it. This is fire. Oh, wow. Oh, they got demons. They don't got the cards that we're trying to look at. Don't mind me. I'm trying to get used to these. Oh my God. This is just a, a regular haircut. I know, but look at it. It's like specked out so good. These people know what they're doing. Shout out. Comment down below which one of you guys would take home. Whichever car. Me personally, I would take the GT3 RS. Damn. This one is tough. I changed my mind, I'll take the ZR1. Wow, look at this. Guys, I would really like something like this. I don't know. What do you guys think? Wow, is this the one Paul Walker? Yeah, the same jacket, the same, same color. Wow, no way. R.I.P. 54 anniversary Mustang? 45, 45th anniversary. 45th? Yeah. 45 only made. Guys, that ZR1 was... Should I trade in all the cars in for that? It was $269,000. 12 miles on it. Look on Google, I have been What the heck? Babe, let me do it. No, babe. Guys, I would get a two door. I We're gonna get, get a two door. It's just yeah, we will. which one are we gonna get? Yeah. The GT3 so RS. Future wise, we're not we're not gonna get it right now. You guys comment down below what you guys want to think and like would want to see in the future. GT3 RS. That ZR1 is competitive, bro. Or an STO Lamborghini. I love the fact that they even when we walked in, we said, "Oh, we're like just looking." They're like, "Oh, okay." Go. Yeah, they just let us look. Big shout out to Fusion Luxury Motors. We will be back. Okay, guys. So we're at our next stop. We are at the Lamborghini and Bentley dealership. So it's kind of like all three combined. It's Genesis, Lamborghini, and Bentley. This McLaren is so nice. But if I see a Bentley Continental GT, I think it's over. I think it's over. I think it's over. And I see one right now and it's all black. Maybe we shouldn't have came. Yeah, I think we should get a Continental GT. We shouldn't have came here. Guard just asked if I see him in this. Yes, I do, baby. This shit is so low. It's very low. That's why people, I think, have <laughs> back problems after. Oh, oh, oh. Not really. I can see me in it, though. I love the face of them. Wow. It is 407, honey. Yeah, I'd rather get a Lamborghini. But look, that's the one that we came to come look at, right? Very nice, very nice. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? B for Britney. <laughs> they got an Audi. They got an R8. They also got over here, babe. This is the one that you've liked a lot. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Okay guys, so we're gonna look at the inside of this one. They it's just a- The Lambo trucks guys are like backed up until 2025 because everyone ordered it. You guys, the back of this Aston Martin is insane. I just don't like the color, but I mean, the color I don't really care about. This guy's looking inside. Inside is blue. Inside is blue? What is the price on that? 219? This is nice. This is tilted, so... What the... So it's like 10,000 off. Oh this my god, this has wide interior. <laughs> you guys see Bernie in this? <laughs> it's like 500k, huh? Ask him, ask him, ask him. You ask him, ask him. You ask him, you ask him. Oh shit. That shit is sick, babe. Yeah. I don't know, B for Britney. She might change her mind, guys. Oh, uh, wow. I love the smell. <sighs> B for Britney. Edition 12, this is the last V12, I guess. Okay, it's roomy. You think? Yeah. You think it's roomy back there? Imagine all red, steering wheel. I know, I've seen them. It has a B for you. Oh my gosh. B 
for Brittany. Welcome, make this Bentley your own. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. The key's so much better than the Range Rovers. Oh my gosh. This only has how many miles, you said? This wasn't pre-owned, right? No, oh. 40 miles. <laughs> Look at the key. I know. It's calling your name. Please. But look at the brake pad. I know. There's a B on it. Rev it. Hello. <laughs> I don't know, guys. B, Bentley, Brittany. It just fits together so well. Oh, oh my interior. God. It's green? Yeah, it's slime green on the inside. Guys, I don't know if you guys could see that, but Dub Ah uh, Rolls Royce. I don't know. This gives me like, you got to be driven around in. This is like, you have to be old. No, like. or you got to be driven in. <laughs> This is crazy. The carbon on the inside, it's not forged carbon. It's carbon, but it's a different... It's reptilian carbon. Oh, wow. Oh, look at it. It has like Tiffany blue on the inside. It smells so good. It smells like a BMW. Or a BMW smells like a Rolls Royce. That's why I was saying reptilian carbon. Like, I don't even want to get in to get dirty. I know. That's why I'm not getting in it. Oh, look at the stars. What's the price on this one? Oh, the stars? Guys, there's stars in here. Guys, take screenshots right now and send them to Garak. Bro, this is sick, bro. Half a million dollars, guys. Is it worth it? I think it's worth 300K, in my opinion. Look at this purple GT3 RS. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. Look at the wing on this. This is an older model, though. But oh, wow. That is it for today's video, you guys. We hope you liked it. And let me know what you guys think about each and every one of the cars that we went and saw. As you guys know, I already have my heart set. Don't know when I'm going to get it. It'll come when it comes, honestly. And you guys will honestly see that video when I do get the car. I'm very happy and I'm very, very blessed to be in the position that I am in, you guys, to be able to have these type of cars. I don't think, like, I we'll can- We'll never stop getting cars. <laughs> but yeah you guys it's all thanks to you guys and it's all by the grace of god and i just want to say thank you guys so much guys yes our podcast is coming very very soon sooner than you guys think we're actually going right now to go do some more shopping for the podcast i am overall very excited like i'm very excited you guys don't forget to also follow us on all of our socials they'll be down below in the link in the description so that way you guys can get any type of updates about the podcast when the youtube channel is coming out we're gonna be having a TikTok channel for it. We're gonna be having a YouTube channel for it. I'm excited! I have been wanting to do a podcast since we first started being influencers. This actually coming true is crazy to me. I've been putting my heart and soul into this, you guys. Big things coming, guys, and we're still gonna be consistent on everything, so stay tuned. We love you guys. Stay safe. Good night, good afternoon, good morning, whatever the fuck it is. And GMB out.